pass you to? Hell? I will take exceptions to you talking to me like this because I hit this your 1980s scrap of a car. <laughs> what did you just say? Did I set your car on fire? No, it can be fixed. You can't even apologize. Oh, you are definitely going to fix this car. You are going to fix this car. Today, today, you are going to fix this car. You can't even apologize. Are you going to call your mechanic or should I call mine? You better call your mechanic because I'm sure your phone is working. I think it's best you call yours, then I'll foot the bill. They write M-U-M-U -U for my head. I resemble Maga. You did Chris. Hey, you won't run me yeah, streets for it. Lagos. Hold it. Madam, call your mechanic and fix my car. Do not talk about your mechanic and I'll foot the bill. I have somewhere important oh, to be at right now. That's I the latest scam, this. Abby. That's the latest scam. Madam, call your mechanic. I don't care about your stinking meeting. You are going to sit your ass down, your big ass for that matter, and fix my car before you go for your smelly meeting. Okay, you know what? Take my car. I'll take yours. When we're I done. I'm taking your car. So what do you want me to do? Fix my car. No, fine. Spoil my car and you're insulting Sammy, me. please, where are you? Okay, I'm coming Just to your place now. All right. <laughs> you're you gonna better learn. drive behind You're me. gonna learn. You spoil my car and you're insulting me. You can't even apologize. Drive you're gonna me. learn. You will learn. I am sorry. I had an accident. Please. Yes, I was five hours late, but please. Don't do this to me, please, Mr. Phillips. But I have all the documents. Everything is intact. Sorry? You gave the contract to someone else? Mr. Phillips, please now. You... He... Mr. Phillips, hello? Hello? just gone in the wind because I bashed that girl's car. Shadi should have not seen the car. Ah. Hmm. A major contract gone because you wouldn't say you're sorry. I beg your pardon? I don't speak Swahili in Tana. A major contract gone because you wouldn't humble yourself and say you are sorry. So I should have double or rolled on the floor, Abby? You should have gotten off your high horse and say sorry to the lady in whose car you bashed. Shade, did I make a mistake inviting you to my house? No, you made a mistake by allowing your pride and your stubborn nature to hold better part of you. Shade, I'm begging you, head your to me or no, you better shut your mouth or I'll shut it for you. Are you serious? Shade, get out. Hmm. Shade, get out! See my house! You want no more. Kill on coming. Shade, get out. Leave, 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 leave.
God, I am. I'm sorry. Okay. I had a rough day, and see, that your daughter really drove me crazy. And yes, I acted out of character, but God, you know my heart. I'm, I'm, I'm actually sorry. Please forgive me. I know I lost my cool and I shouldn't have done that, but I take responsibility. Lord, please help me minister to her heart. Help her to forgive me. In Jesus' name I pray. you strategically placed yourself and your car in a place where I could hit you and then fix it and now you've placed yourself in a way I will hit you and probably fix your skull or your leg who sent you Wait, hold on hold on first of all I did not strategically place my car for you to hit it I was on my way to work and you hit me secondly I woke up on the right side of bed decided to take a run and I saw you here I only came to apologize for the other day I'm Kemma. anything wrong in you asking her to fix your car for you you know i know i know but you know me normally i wouldn't do anything like that it's because of the way she reacted oh like i would just tell someone not to repatch my car it just go like that without working on my car oh please i know i know normally i wouldn't do it which was why i'm apologizing to her i mean it's not me you know me personally that's not how i'll behave of course i know you it's fine. <laughs> Let me start going. Oh, I don't just no come up, please. No problem. Good morning, Mazza. Um, house sixty two. What do you need a passport? Freedom.
What's wrong? Hi. Hi. So what's wrong? What's wrong with your car? What's wrong with your car? Oh, yeah, my car, it, um, it just refused to start. Okay, you try and get it started. Let me see what it's on. Okay. Thank you. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. You see? It just won't start. I think it's the batteries. But I just changed these batteries. It happens sometimes. Do you want me to fix it? I can help. Are you a mechanic? <laughs> Maybe I am. Maybe you can fix me. <laughs> just kidding. Um, yes, please. All right, hold on. How can I thank you? I don't want you to thank me. I just want to see you again. Okay, someone has a way with words. Ah, I try. <laughs> I take that as a compliment. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, I don't know your name. Because you never asked. I'm asking. My name is Alvin. What's yours? <laughs> my name is Kema. Kema. Yeah, my friends call me Kema. Full name is Ekema, actually. Nice. Mm -hmm. So, why are you staring at me like that? <laughs> <laughs> Do I have something on my face that belongs to you? <laughs> Maybe. Perhaps. You are, otherwise, you'll, I'll make your car stop. <laughs> All right. Okay, then. I'll call you. I'll be waiting for your call. You better do.
like a holiday a bottle of wine over milkshake you are bold baby and there's no maybe oh no I got butterflies feel so crazy yeah yeah Feel so empty without you here. You're all I need. You're all I need. You're my heartbeat. You're my heartbeat. You're all I need. You're all I need. Baby, I'm all yours. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bixie! Oh, baby! My baby! Look at my beautiful sister. Come on, Fitz. Uh -uh. What's going on? You know how it is now. The normal stress, Abuja, stress, hustle, and everything. Come on, Fitz. You're not laughing at stress. 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 You don't want me, Avi. The time you say I find you, they want yeah, me to see yourself now. Look at you. No. <laughs> come on, Finn. I missed you. I missed you too. Come on, come, come inside. Oh, that's bring it the bag. Bring it the bag. I cooked your favorite meal. Oh my God. A baby. I didn't say you were a baby. I said you were my baby. I am not your baby. Oh, really? Yes. I mean, you don't want the estate girl saying me calling you baby. <laughs> I saw. <laughs> hey, God. Speaking about the estate girls, I helped one beautiful, charming, babe. Guy, calm down now. You've not been in this estate for up to two hours. Are you already helping babes? I didn't say babes. I didn't say women. I said babe. One girl. Okay. Yes. <laughs> nothing, nothing to it. Just helped her, you know, put things together, make sure she was she was good. Mm, good Samaritan. I see you. So now you want to tell me that you just helped her to fix her car and you didn't collect her number. I mean it's only grass to be collected. I collected number now. Sharp guy, sharp guy, sharp guy, sharp guy. Get out. <laughs> Get out. Hey, my brother. You're a pro. Put the woman be ready, okay?
You know a fly will get into your mouth if you don't shut it, right? <laughs> I'm sorry. You are the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Oh, thing? I'm many things, but not a thing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Yeah, but thanks for the compliment. You're welcome. Most beautiful. Hmm? Right. Beyonce has got nothing on you. Okay, hold on. You need to slow down with the pickup lines. Oh, no. no. Plus, I don't want the beehive to come after me. These aren't pickup lines. They are truths from the deepest recesses of my heart. Okay. All right. Shall we? We shall. <laughs> What exactly do you want to know about me? You already know my name. I'm a Kema. Kema for short. <laughs> and I'm from Anambra State, Newe to be precise. I'm the only child of my parents who are there late. I grew up with my auntie in Lagos and I finished from Unilag with a second class OPA in banking and finance. Currently work as an investment banker and I am single, not searching. For I real. See. I see. Okay. All right, that's cool. So, what about you? You've just been listening to my <laughs> story of my life. <laughs> Tell me about you. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, so about me, you already know my name. My name is Alvin. Alvin Obanikoro. I'm from Lagos State, specifically Surulere. Both parents, gratefully, are still alive. Yeah. Lucky you. Like some of us. I'm sorry. 
my parents live in London, and um, I live in Nigeria here with my sister and I. My sister's name is Christiana, Tiana for short. It's just the two of you? Yeah, just the both of us. Um, she's uh, into interior decoration and she has a clothing line and I manage put stores in a project. That's you? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> it's alright. And uh, yeah, I am single and searching. Well, I think I, I think I've already found what I'm looking for, so I don't think I'm searching anymore. Oh yeah. You have? Yes, I have. Feels like a holiday. Kema, I know this might come as a shock, probably a bombshell, but I like you a lot. From the moment I saw you, I just felt like I found something special. I don't know, call it whatever you want. I know. I know. You could say it's love at first sight. I don't care, but I'm in love with you and I know it. I feel so empty without you here. You're all I need. You're all I need. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, feels like a holiday. Bottle of wine over milkshake. You are both, baby, and there's no maybe. Oh no, I got butterflies. Feel so crazy. for coming. No, I should be the one thanking you for such a treat. I enjoyed myself. It's my pleasure. She makes the stars completely jealous. And then when she walks, I have no choice but to just stand there and stare at her. Okay, my brother is in love. She's, I'm telling you, she's just amazing. 
She's the best thing that's ever happened to me. Hold on, me. hold on. You said the same thing about Chidera, right? <sighs> Come on, you and I know that Chidera was a mistake. Uh, let me guess, Jennifer too was a mistake. Uh, okay, okay, you? listen, what I have with this woman is a far cry from these women you just mentioned. Okay. Okay? okay. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe if you shag her and you still feel the same way, mm -hmm. with this, uh, what's her name, Kelechi Abi? Kema, Kema. Okay, Kema. Mm -hmm. Okay, no problem. She'll be in a shag. Oh, yeah, no, no problem. I will see. Okay, so maybe after you guys have shagged and you still feel this way, then maybe I'll kind of like, believe me, small, just small. <laughs> okay, no problem. <laughs> we'll get to that. <laughs> okay, so do you have a picture? Let me see now. Let me uh, see this hoity toity. Okay, come to think about it, I was too busy in love, professing love. I forgot to take a picture. But don't worry, tomorrow I'm going to meet her and I'll, I won't forget to take a picture. I'll show you. For oh, sure. wow. Okay, so you guys are missing tomorrow, right? For sure. So bring her over now. For real? Yes, now. You said she lives in the estate. So just bring her. Let me see. Sharp. Okay. Uh, let me look at her. Let me scrutinize her now. Oh, you nice know? One, nice one, yes, nice now. Uh-uh. Nice uh, nice my nice G. My brother is in love. I'll let you know. I'll let okay. you know. Okay. Voila. Okay. I'll do it with you now. Tomorrow. Voila. <laughs> so tell me, what do you think? My sister wouldn't like the idea of us. Mm, I don't know. I just, I just have a feeling your sister might not like me. My sister is educated. She's enlightened. We spent a lot of time in London. The last thing on her mind is whatever worries you have right now about anything. She just wants me to be happy. Okay. All right. If you say so. <laughs> so, you're coming tomorrow, right? Uh, no. Maybe next tomorrow. Why not? Why not tomorrow? Come on. Room wasn't built in a day out. Just slow down. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Okay, 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 okay. That's fine. But we're hanging out tomorrow, Sha. Um, yes. <laughs> okay, that's music to my ears. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Miss me already? I'm on my way. <laughs> I'll be there. Okay, see you soon. Bye. <laughs> hey, 
This is. How's it going? It's been like so this excited. So where is she? Ah, she's almost here. A second from now. Okay. Um, food is almost ready, but there are enough drinks for you guys, so everything is in some points. Thank you. So I thought you were supposed to show me her picture. She's, she's literally almost here. You're going to see her. What you need to see a picture. Let me just see what she looks like now. So if she's ugly, I won't even bother coming now. Just ugly. Like ugly care. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, hold on. Oh. Yeah. She's fine. 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 Isabel. Right, you, know, you know her? This witch. You unforgiving bitch. You. Wait, 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 wait calm down. What, shut what, what, up. What? Just shut up. So, of all places, it's my own blood brother. Abby? <laughs> Kama didn't even take you to hell or anywhere else. It had to be my house. Wait, sis, can you just calm down and talk to me? Jezebel, destroyer of kingdoms. Listen. Witch again. Why? Because witches deserve to be killed and not loved. Yes! Baby. Yeah, I'm trying to Baby, come. Baby. Baby, please, can we just. My car, and then when they fix her car, I'll return it to her. She also refused. I then asked her to let me foot the bill. I stayed in that dingy mechanic village for five good hours waiting for that scrap of a car that she owned. And then she seized my food. So how was I supposed to reach Mr. Philip when I get to Blue Waters? They saw me as a joke. And then I lost that mega contract. Alvin, that was my big break. My big break. They gave it to some other girl who doesn't even have the experience that I have. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sis. Don't, don't do that. Having those, I need you to please break up with that girl. Sis, can you just calm down? Please, just calm down. Having, you would do as I say.
vengeance has never been my favorite. I just, it's just not something I believe in. I know that deep inside each one of us there's good and evil. That day, your sister's pride got the best of me. I, I'm not saying I'm a saint. I'm not saying I'm, I'm the best of humans, but she just brought out the beast in me and I overreacted. I know. I know because I pray to God and I ask for forgiveness. I... I didn't know my actions would cost her her career or something that grand. I, I honestly didn't know. I was just, I was just, I reacted. I should have taken my time to think and respond maturely, but I reacted. I did my best to apologize. I ran into her one of those mornings when I was going for a run and I crossed over to apologize but she just blew me off. I didn't know karma would do this to me. Finally, I get a chance at love again. And it turns out she's your sister. Went to see her, right? Yes. I just went to hear her side of the story. Her side? For what reason? Did I lie? No. Why? No. Everything you said is true. She admitted every single thing. She agreed to it. But sis, she's also sorry. She's sorry, she's broken, and she's in tears. <laughs> okay, interesting. So what am I supposed to do with that piece of information? Since as I speak to you, she's at home. She's in desperate need of your forgiveness. She tried so many times to try and look for you, to reach you, but she was scared. She's, she's broken right now. She's crying. She's, she's sorry. She, she let her emotions just run wild. She made a mistake. Alvin, I'm not God. I cannot forgive her. Because of the love I have for you, I can't let you end up with that girl. She's heartless. She's a wicked soul. I can't. You're my only brother. Alvin, you're all that I have. Alvin, please. Please. 
You cannot! This is not possible because I am already in love with her. I'm already in love with her. What do you want me to do? Calvin. A friend to my enemy. just came to Okay, I'm sorry about that. I I just came to hug you before I go to bed. And Out of my house. Since you're going to chase me out of your house by this time of the night. I am not just sending you out of my house. I'm sending you out of my life. So get out. Out! I told you Kemma said she's sorry. She's sorry. She doesn't even need to tell me she's sorry. To hell with her sorry. To hell with her apology. And to hell with you. Now get out! Seriously. And I'm not just throwing you out of this house. I'm throwing you out of my house in Abuja. And my store, you cease to manage them. I've called my general manager. So get out! Go! Go and live with that witch so you guys can live happily ever after! Go! Can you just calm down? Go! Go!
feels like a holiday A bottle of wine or a milkshake You are both baby And there's no maybe Oh no I got butterflies Feel so crazy Yeah, yeah Feel so empty Without you here You're all I need You're all I need You're my heartbeat Girl, you're my peace You're all I need You're all I need Baby, I'm all yours Yeah, oh yeah Together, forever Whenever, however Baby, I'm all yours, yeah, yeah. Together, forever, oh, yeah. whenever, oh, no. however. Baby, I'm all yours, oh yeah. Together, oh, forever, no. whenever, however. See, I fit the grace for you, go in the land for you. I fit to die for you, girl, oh girl, yeah. This love not me and you And you know that it's true Nobody else but you, girl, oh girl, yeah Feel so empty without you here You're all I need, you're all I need You're my heart Your smile What about my smile? I don't understand why are you still smiling? How are you able to do it? You literally just lost everything. Mm. Your sister, your job, the shelter over your head, and you're smiling. Well, I didn't lose the one thing that means everything to me. And that's you, Kim. I don't want you to be at loggerheads with your sister. Maybe you should find someone else to love. I should find someone else? Yes. Tell me, how can I find someone else? When all I think about is you, when I think about love. Hmm? It's okay, let me get it. out of your so you seem to greet me. You will come to my house and insult me this morning. You must be stupid. You are daft. Where's my brother? I'm not. Oh. Hey! So Alvin, she has now given you that poison that you're raising your voice at me. Tana, please calm down. Oh, shut your mouth, you this witch. There's only one witch here, that's you. You must be mad. Eh? You want to fight me? You want to... Wait, wait. Oh. your things you're leaving this estate right now hmm? i gave you access into the estate and now i say you are leaving i revoked the asset he back right yes and he is my brother listen to me not even jupiter can take me out of this estate there's nothing you can do about it really yes watch me
Babe. Babe. chatting about like obviously you know she's missing where is she Kema is missing why would you do this why would you stoop so low why would you do this sis Alvin, why would you do this make this make sense what am i supposed to do with your missing girlfriend or you think i abducted her the witch screamed the night before and then the baby dies the next morning who do you think killed it my friend go and pick your clothes where you had your bath <laughs> you're not going to talk to me right Maybe you will talk to the police instead. such a sweet soul. Why would they do this to her? My sister is behind all this. How are you so sure about this, Alvin? I mean, who else? Kema never told me of any known enemy. Huh. Kema will never hurt a fly. That's my point exactly. The only person Kema has stepped on her toes is my sister, Tana. So how are you so sure about this? You don't know Tana. Of all the people with short temper that God created, she's the one I fear the most. The missing person was in a love affair with your kid brother. You condemned training everything to bring down that, that love affair. And you're sitting down here, you're telling the Nigeria police, you know nothing about the disappearance of Ike Maubi. Officer, I know nothing about her disappearance. Madam, do you know that adoption under the law is punishable? But officer, I've told you everything I know, which is the truth. Oh, really? Officer, yes, I was not in support of the relationship from the onset. I must have condemned 
And yes, I threatened to make sure the relationship doesn't see the day of light. But kidnapping, I would never do such a thing. So, you're telling me that the judge will buy the story of yours? Officer, I am not the kidnapper. Look at me. I'm not a kidnapper. I put it to you that you know everything about the disappearance of Ikema Obi. Officer, I put it to you that there's a kidnapper out there. And here you are, threatening and making me to admit to a crime I know absolutely nothing about. I just got out of a very horrible relationship. He was really sweet when we met. We were inseparable. We wanted to do life together. We wanted to be together forever. We got to spend more time together, and then I realized he was a beast, a narcissist. He was sick. He would yell at Will at the slightest provocation. He would The first time he hit me, I said I was going to leave, and then he cried and begged and said his life was meaningless without me and I just, I stayed. I thought it would change. Things just dwindled. One day, he picked up a knife and almost stabbed me to death. What? That was when I left the relationship. I totally just walked out. And then he would... He would pay me random visits at odd hours. He would just show up at my doorsteps. He started threatening me. I had to call the security and just alert the police. It was after then that he backed off. And he... He hasn't bothered me since then. He started picking up pieces of my life. The weird thing about it is he lives just two streets away. Road 15, house 4. Such a creep. Why did you say his name was again? Thomas. Thomas. Tom, but I don't think so. Jackie, that guy was abusive. He was constantly physical with Kemma. Everything that happened between Kema and Thomas. I've not totally forgotten. But uh, Tom can't go as far as kidnapping Kema. You don't know what guys would do when they're heartbroken, it's okay? So uh, do you intend going to ask Tom if he's with your woman? No, I can't. 
Then how do you want to go about it? say about an eye for an eye it leaves every man blind oh, but some geez. of us some of us are willing to lose both eyes oh, to gain vengeance oh, you, you took you. my heart and crushed it into you pierced a knife in my heart through my soul you turned me into an object of mockery can I, can I explain please I, I I was hey it was easy for you Fall in love with that stupid man. Yes. I followed you. I trailed you. I knew all about the qualms that you had with his sister. But when the time was right, I decided to strike. I beg you. Please. I will be saying my last prayers right now. I will be asking the Lord to keep my soul. Please. Even as I close my eyes. Please. Are you okay? They didn't hurt you. They didn't hurt you. of me. They actually took me for interrogation to ask me about that missing girl. So Alvin can do this after everything we have been through. After everything Alvin and I have been through, he decided to report me because of that witch. That girl. Oh. Tana. Uh -uh. Tana. What? You know I'm your friend. And I always tell you the truth. Tana. 
You have already implicated yourself by threatening that lady. Your brother will believe you have a hand in adoption of that lady. So, the way forward right now is to apologize and allow them to enjoy their love life. Tana. Mm -mm. After everything I went through, I calm lost the call. Calm down. Calm down. Shade Oti Oti. Could possible Rara. Calm down, Tana. Let it be. Blow the sticker than water. Calm down. Calm down. Door, don't worry, I won't be kidnapped again. <laughs> Calm down. What do you want? Is Alvin in? Yes. I guess I should have forgiven you for everything that happened, including me losing the contract. I'm sorry I made you miss your meeting. I guess letting go is the new call. Our story is definitely proof to that. No, maybe. 